Hello viewers, this is uh, Saju from tallygame.com and this time I am with a simple tutorial on how to round off in GST invoice. Earlier I had a video, I have created, I had created a video about uh, uh, rounding off and that time we used uh, voucher class method. Now in this tutorial I will show you a new feature that is implemented by Tally, or Tally uh, company and uh, let's check it from the gateway of Tally accounts info and ledger create let's create a round of ledger round of and this may be indirect expense or indirect income uh, it depends on the uh, balance if it is uh, debit balance uh, then you can choose indirect expense uh, it, sometimes it may be credit balance then you can choose indirect income and you can change it at the end of the financial year if required now come to the type of ledger here is the option and you can see discount and uh, invoice rounding choose the invoice rounding and uh, two more options has come in the screen and rounding method there are three methods normal rounding upward rounding downward rounding i think uh, you know about it however i will explain uh, normal rounding may be upward norm, normal rounding may be upward rounding or downward rounding for example if the total invoice value is 75 rupees then 75 rupees 25 pa 25 paise then it will come down to the nearest uh, smaller value that is 75 rupees if it is more than 50 paise i mean fraction is more than 55 paise so suppose 75.80 then it will uh, go up to the nearest bigger value you will go to the nearest bigger value that is uh, 76 rupees and uh, downward what is downward rounding uh, if the whatever may be the fraction if it is 80 paise 20 paise it will come to the come down to the nearest smaller value and uh, upward rounding is just opposite of uh, downward rounding whatever may be the fraction it will go up to the nearest bigger value that is 75 if it is 75.20 it will round it up to 76 rupees so here i am choosing upward rounding okay and the rounding limit rounding limit you can set to 1 rupees 10 rupees 100 rupees based on your business and your policy you can set uh, here i am i am i am not changing uh, one rupees keep keep it there and uh, save round of ledger now let's end up a gst sales voucher from the gateway of tally accounting voucher and uh, type the reference number and uh, choose the party and enter the sub supplementary details party details here uh, here i am leaving it blank and select the sales ledger now uh, name of the item here i have created sp laptop and uh, quantity is 10 number and value is 25999 and choose the cgst and sgst ledger whatever may be sometimes uh, if it is interstate sale igst may be applicable here now the you can see the total amount three lakhs six thousand seven hundred and eighty eight point two zero so i have chosen upward rounding so if i select a round round of ledger here it will go up you can see three lakh six thousand seven hundred eighty nine if you want to check uh, norm downward rounding just uh, place the cursor here and uh, press control and uh, you can edit ledger from there here 
choose uh, downward rounding and save this thing now it has come down to the nearest smaller value 3 lakhs 6,788 now let's see how this will print click on print or you can use alt P now let's see the preview we are already in preview mode with preview if you click with preview you can see the preview of the invoice with preview now click on yes click on so you can see round off ledger is printed in the invoice also so hope you <coughs> hope this tutorial helped thank you